Hi, and welcome to Wagstaff Explains. Today's topic, translations. Let's take a look at our first question. Move the figure five units to the left and two units down. Record the new vertices of the translated image in the table below. Okay, so first we want to start by marking where we're going to move our figure. So we're moving our figure five units left. So we'll start with A as a reference point. So one, two, three, four, five. All right, so five units to the left and two units down. So one, two. Okay, so now I can mark this as a prime, which is at negative three, three. And then B, same process. So I am going five to the left. So one, two, three, four, five, and then two down, one, two. So here is my location of B prime. And that is at one, zero, negative one, zero. And then for C, same process, one, two, three, four, five, and two down, one, two. And so here is C prime, and it's at negative four, negative one. And so I'm going to connect my points so I can see what the triangle looks like. Okay, looks pretty good. And so I do want to check and make sure that I translated it correctly and that it's the same image. So I'm just going to slide this over here and yes, it is translated correctly. And so now for the rule. So we went five to the left, five to the left indicates subtracting five and two units down indicates subtracting two. So we have X on the X axis. We are subtracting five. And on the y-axis, we are subtracting 2. So y minus 2. And now we're done. So let's take a look at our next question. Record the new vertices of the translated image and the rule in the table. Okay, so we have ABC, triangle ABC, and then triangle ABC prime and it has been translated. So we'll use A as our point of reference. So it looks like we're traveling down and to the right. So how many units down did we go? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we went seven units down And we went one, two, three to the right. So along the X axis, so that would be positive three. Okay. All right, so let's take a look at our locations of our points. So A prime is at five, negative two. B prime is at seven, negative five. And C prime is at four, negative six. And our rule was X plus three. And on the Y axis, we subtracted seven. And I'm just going to check this just to be sure. 
So if I take this x value and I add 3, I do get 5. And if I take 5 and subtract 7, I do get negative 2. I'm going to leave you with the translation rules. Thank you for watching another episode of Wagstaff Explains. Now you know how to translate figures.